Hi guys. Hi guys. Welcome to Glasshammer Gaming. Glasshammer Gaming specializes in all competitive aspects of Warhammer 40k, like the awesome 2000 point competitive ITC battle report you're about to see right now. <laughs> My god, that was a mouthful. Yeah, that was very a... pro, very pro. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> I am using Raven Scars in other hands uh Pigeon scratch. Oh, ugly, that's what we're going for. Ugly pigeons. Ugly pigeons. <laughs> there you go. That's what we're going for. So I, uh, this is my first run out with Marines, and I thought, let me see what all the fuss is about. Mm -hmm. You know, everyone's everyone's on them, and I'll do it. And I think I'm a, uh, I'm already starting to find out that um, the composition of the list with command points might be a little tight. <laughs> I did try and warn him. I tried to warn him, but he what? wasn't having any of it. What am I? Uh, what are my Raven scars up against, Dan? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm on Imperium this week, guys. Uh, so man is taking my Marines off me. So I'm about to uh, go digging in the back, see what I could find, and right at the bottom, like covered in dust, <laughs> was a box of custodies. So I've brought them back out. Uh, so I, I thought, you're going to Cladius? Yeah. yeah. You're going to Cladius? And I'm no Cladius. No, no okay. That's no, the way to no, do it, guys. No, no, rubbish. No, no, rubbish. <laughs> rubbish. Uh, no yeah, so uh, I, th I, think, uh, I think they definitely deserve a place back on the tabletops now, now that a few things have shifted around. So, um, yeah. Like the lights of nights. Mm. Uh, panicking to go on the table against marines and stuff so with marines liking to hide and stuff mm. i think that plays into the custodes hands like they can jump over terrain and charge and mm. yeah, they're yeah. quite good against marines in combat and marines yeah. aren't very good against them in combat let's yeah. say with no ap and stuff like doesn't yeah. matter how many angels of death attacks you can you can get <laughs> by charging and being marines you're not going to get through yeah. a two up save at top yeah. of the six so exactly yeah hopefully that goes uh quite well for the custodes let's see because you know it'd be oh. good to see them back on the table well I hope so mate I hope so it's, it's about time I got some wins on the board eh? yeah you never know it might be like, <laughs> oh my god you passed the two up save <laughs> oh my god you rolled one <laughs> dice and passed the two up save <laughs> but uh, yeah it might come to that guys you never know <laughs> <laughs> we're playing ITC Mission 3 which is Nexus Control over to the list Oh, uh, man, he's been mean and he's taken Marines off me because he's well gel of all the fun that I've been having. So um, he's <laughs> he's kicked me off them this week so he can uh, he can try something silly out. Um, so this is what I've come up with. So look, guys, look, they're back, they're back. Basically, thinking behind these is um, Imperial Knights have taken a bit of a battering recently with all these Smash Captains and Last Cannons and stuff coming out. So I think... Well, competitive players have definitely edged away from knights. Uh, so I think... And that was really the only thing that killed these, to be fair. So uh, we'll give these a go. I mean, they're quick, they hit hard, they kill marines really well. So um, they've definitely got a place in an army, I think. I've then got two battalions. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Shield Captain, three Virtus Praetors. The Shield Captain, I'll pay a CP and give him the super bike with the three up in foot. And the reroll charges. And then I've got two battalions. In that, I have uh, three tank commanders. They've all got battle cannons. That's it. They've got no sponsons. Um, I've got uh, three company commanders. Uh, all just three different ones because they look cool. Three mortar teams, all with uh, mortars, heavy weapon teams with mortars, and 60 guardsmen. Also in that is 85 points spare for me to choose an assassin of my choice. Uh, which, let's face it, it's going to be an episode. <laughs> so guys, this is my first run out with Marines. It is pure Marines, of course, but it's not pure one chapter. So I've gone for successors, and my army is Raven Scars. That's what we're going to call them, Raven Scars. So I've got Raven Guards and White Scars in two battalions. So the first battalion is this Raven Guard battalion. So I have a Smash Captain with a storm shield and thunder hammer and i have a chaplain with a jump pack now this is my warlord smash captain and i have three units of scouts and then i have three units of assault centurions so i have two units with hurricane bolters and flamers and the one unit of four you could see in the middle slightly bigger squad because they're going to be advancing up the board they don't have hurricane bolters they just have the flamers and the vests and then You've got three Thunderfire Cannons as well, just to provide some support over a couple of turns, you know, stop people taking Engineers and that kind of stuff. And the successors that I've picked for these guys 
are long range marksmen. So I've got an extra three inch range on all those lovely flamers on the Centurions, plus everything else in the army. But I mainly did it for the Centurion flamers. And then I've got Artisans of War because it gives one reroll to hit and wound, which will be pretty nice for three Thunderfire Cannons over six turns, just sitting at the back rerolling one hit roll and wound roll each every turn. So that's pretty cool. And then I have my White Scars Battalion, and they are White Scars. They're not successors because I want to be able to advance and charge with all of them as well. So I have my Smash Captain on the bike, on the bike for some reasons we'll come to. Then I have a Phobos Librarian, who has the plus two to advance and charge power, and also the no overwatch power. Then I have three units of five scouts, all with combat weapons, because white scars. And then I have one unit of five aggressors, with all the guns in the world, and the fists. And then I have two units of vanguard. Now the vanguard units are exactly the same. There are four guys with a storm shield and chainsword in each unit, to make them a bit survivable. And then three guys with double chainsword. And the sergeant is also one of the guys with double chainsword just so you've got as many attacks as possible in those units. Now, here's the interesting thing, guys. So, got to zoom out a bit and show you the entire army while I do this. I'm starting the game with 13 command points. The Raven Guard's Warlord trait is the one where I can redeploy a unit 9 inches after seize. And then I'm going to pay one command point to give that same Warlord advance and charge for everybody within 6 inches of him. So there's one command point gone. His free relic is the one that's going to make him 4 damage on his hammer. So there's one command point gone on Raven Guard. So I'm down to 12. Then my White Scars Libby is taking the relic for plus 1 casting on his powers. Down to 11. My White Scars Biker Guy is going to take a Warlord trait. So I'm down to 10. And then he's also going to take the Relic Bike that allows him to ignore terrain. So I am down to 9 command points before the game. 12... 11, 10, 9. Yes, I'm down to 9 command points. And that's before I use any deep strike or redeploy shenanigans. So I think I'm going to find out how hard it is to actually compose a marine list and play it for the first time right now, guys. 9 CP at the start. Right, deployment is over, um, and if anyone's got any better ideas, please let me know, because <laughs> I, I, I mean, I've read the Raven Guard books, so I know what they could do, and I just haven't got a bloody clue. I mean, you can see why it was, um, it was Raven Guard, uh, Raven Guard on Raven Guard on the top table at the Grass Hammer Open, because I just, there's nowhere I can go. If, if Honest to God, if Manning goes first here... This could be one of the shortest battle reports I think we've ever had. Basically, I've put, uh, I worked out how far his Centurions can come. Because um, they deploy nine inches away. Then they move and advance. Then they can move and advance and charge. And it's just, it's like the lines up to here. So I can't deploy out of it. So I put a line of Guardsmen here. So he can only move up to an inch away from them. Then he's got 11 inch Flamers because of his silly chapter, successor chapter tactic thing, right? So these guys are just over 11 inches from the front line so um so these guys he can't move forward and flame them then i've put these guys just behind here because i know he can come over with his silly characters you know the, the guy on the bike and the the guy that infiltrates with the centurions and beat the crap out of these guys because they're like one of them's flat four damage and then you know the smash captains they've got loads of attacks each so i've lined up a couple of um infantry squads in front of them. Now I am well aware that he has Thunderfire Cannons which can clear the infantry squads and then his characters can come in and beat the crap out of them. But he has to commit his characters first. 
And if things got, he has to get rid of two lines because I've kind of placed my guardsmen slightly in front of them. So things can go wrong with the shooting phase, and that means he sacrifices characters for no reason. That is the best thing I could come up with. Is hope mine gets unlucky, which we're all well aware. If you're rel- <laughs> if you're relying on that, you know you're up shit shit street, right? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. So, but I mean, please. Guys, answers on a postcard. I, I have absolutely no idea how I can, st- or I can minimise the damage coming in from this alpha strike, because it's just going to be brutal, man. Um, I wanted my smash captains as far forward as I can to try and put some. Pre- I can't just let Manny have the middle of the board, and kick back and relax and just win the game. So I need them to be as far forward as possible, but at a you know at a reasonable, uh, you know, so so I don't just get they don't just get wiped off the board turn one. And then obviously all my stuff's coming behind. I realise there's a bit of a gap here. But if Manny sends his things over here, at least they're not in the middle of the board. And then I can take the middle of the board. So, and, and I just I just ran out of guardsmen. So, <laughs> this here is what it is. But if he does go there, it's not the end of the world for me, I don't think. And mm-hmm. uh, then my assassin's in the sky. So that's my thoughts. So, obviously guys, I am no marine expert. <laughs> not yet, anyway. I, uh, I've only just read through the White Scars and Raven Guide books properly because this is what I want to run at tournaments. And I'm showcasing it for you guys here. This is my first idea. This is this is 1.0. This is Raven Scars 1.0. Uh, and uh, I, I just think um, Dan's correct about the whole first turn thing. But to me, it's really silly. It would be really silly of me to put my Centroids and my Smash Captain up there turn one and go for it because they would do a bucket and a damage and your screen with all the flamers and the charge off the Centurions into all the Guardsmen and maybe the Smash Captain getting into a Tank Commander. I could probably kill a Tank Commander and tie one up mm-hmm. and then kill the front two lines of screens and hopefully another 10 Guardsmen from the back with the Thunderfires. Yeah. And I think that's, that's a hit that your screen would probably never recover from. Yeah. But of course things can go wrong with that. And that's too much of a gamble to lose the whole, seeing how many objectives you're on for me to hold yes. more, yeah. and seeing how many you need to kill for me to kill more. So I think I'm going to actually want to go second here. Mm-hmm. I think going first wouldn't be the end of the world, because yeah, there's a lot of things I can do. Mm-hmm. But that's the thing. You don't want me to go first, and I want to go second, which yes. is huge, right? Yeah, it's like, yeah, yeah. you can't let a Raven Guard player go first, so you always have to go first, doesn't matter who you are. Well, well this, this is what we said when we like, originally cool. read the book, right? Yeah. We were saying in ITC it plays to the mission really well, because in ITC you want to go second. Yeah. And this and Raven Guard makes your opponent want to go first, yeah. so it's perfect, exactly. right? Yeah. This, this is, yeah it's exactly. So that's it, guys. I mean... This is the video. This video here before the game is about deployment and how we've deployed. But that's something we realised in deployment that your opponent's gonna want to go first because they're not gonna want this kind of alpha strike hitting them turn one, which is perfect for the Raven Guard player because he goes, "I'll redeploy somewhere safe then," because that happens at the start of the first battle round. So after you know who's going first, yeah. I'll redeploy somewhere safe and I'll I'll get the end of battle round, which is absolutely huge in ITC, like everyone knows. Yeah. So what I've done here, guys, is I, I just chucked these Centurions to see if I could try to bait Dan. I just chucked these Centurions <laughs> down here with my Smash Captain because I knew I was going to redeploy them. I was hoping Dan just put his Tank Commanders over here so he could get line of sight to them turn one if he went first. <laughs> <laughs> so that was a bit of a, a bit of a... I reckon I will catch people out with that at tournaments. I reckon a couple of things. Yeah, if, if I hadn't have done that... Maybe that's one thing, guys. So in reserve, I put my I paid to put my aggressors in reserve, my vanguard already go in reserve, and then I paid to put two other units of centurions in reserve. Mm-hmm. So I've put all of that in reserve and I have seven command points left. If I hadn't have done this, if I would have put that unit down first, mm-hmm. and then maybe my opponent thought I've got more to put down and redeploy, mm-hmm. then they would have fallen for it. Mm-hmm. So maybe I should do it in reverse. I'll tell you what, Manny, I'm gonna call this now. We'll go all back over it again in things we could have done differently at the end. Yeah. But I think putting those in reserve is a mistake. Oh, really? I think that's cost you four command points. And with all this line of sight block in here, yeah. and I've got mortars as my outer line of sight thing, Yeah. I don't think they've got any problem walking across the board. Ah, yes. I have a cunning plan with them, though. Oh, a cunning plan with the Centurions. Interesting. <laughs> and then, as you can see, guys, I just put 
three units of scouts here. One, two, three, four units. Four units of scouts here, just outside my deployment zone. Obviously leaving a beautiful bubble for where the Centurions will go <laughs> if I don't go first. <laughs> uh, and then I've got my White Scars characters. Oh, uh, no, sorry. The, the Raven Guard Chaplain is there as well with his jump pack. And I've got my White Scar Smash Captain right there. Uh -huh. And the Phobos Librarian right there. So my bubble of my bubble is roughly around the middle because this L piece helps me hugely. I've left the gap for the Raven Guard Centurions to jump into. Uh -huh. I've got one unit of scouts on that side and one unit of scouts on this side. In case I do get first turn and I can sort of run and maybe wrap some guardsmen and yep. stuff. Yep. And then I've deployed my three Thunderfire Cannons with the Tech Marines just within three inches of them, because you only have to be within three to fire them. And I have basically blocked all of this nine inches back to like here, uh -huh. for that ever sort of drop down. Lovely stuff. Yeah. All right then, mate, so. Just the roll, so you goes first then? Just the roll, yeah, oh so it's a, it's a big one. So I get plus one, which is oh always my huge. God. Oh my god. A two, I get a two. Oh. Yes! Oh, no. oh, screw you, Raven God. Oh, no. So, Dan, what does uh, yeah, that mate, mean? Yeah, mate, I'm going to go first. You're going to go first? Oh, brilliant. I was going to make you go first. Yeah, that's fine. I, there's, there's, I just, I think... You I'm could, not going to seize. I'm not going to seize, but... I think you could absolutely trash me if you go first. But... <laughs> I wouldn't have anyway. So I'm cool with it. <laughs> Uh, right then, so following on from our movement phase, uh, sorry, our deployment of um, I haven't got a clue what I'm doing. Welcome to the movement and the shooting phase of I don't know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> Very nice. So, so basically, I've moved these guardsmen forward here to try and block these centurions just walking out and doing whatever the hell they want. So this is kind of like a bit of a line to stop them moving forward, and then um, everything else here is. Uh, behind over uh, 11 inches from them so that I, the stuff here can't be flamed either um, the reason I haven't blocked this edge off as Manny was asking is if I stand a guardsman here his centurions can stay in there flame and just kill that unit and yep. then yep. And they're still hidden and I need him to come out so um, that's not going to happen so I've issued uh, four move 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 orders to get all these guardsmen into there and I did that while it was sped up save everyone 15 minutes of their lives um, so it's just this guy here to issue two orders and I'm going to do that one where they, they re-roll their hits don't they and they stand oh my god yeah. Uh, yeah, you're Katie aren't you yeah, yeah. So they re-roll ones anyway so yeah if you do so the re-roll ones on them it makes them full re-rolls to re-roll re full re-rolls to hit yeah so so that's what, so he's going to put that on them there and try and kill some scouts I'm going to try and kill some scouts oh no no so <laughs> everyone's on terrain <laughs> all of them so, yeah so basically I've put every guardsman here on terrain apart from obviously these guys so yeah. that was that's the plan try and make it as difficult as I can for those thunderfires of course but they are going to rinse every, a lot anyway so all right, so uh, first lot of mortars onto these scouts in here. Yep. Um, ten shots. Oh my god. Oh my god. So hitting you on fours, right? Yep. Good job you got full rerolls. Or <laughs> not. <laughs> hey, we got about what we should have got anyway. <laughs> and then fours. Oh, that's uh, pretty good. Oh, that made up for it. Uh, five. Three ups. Uh, two die. Yeah, who are they going for? Oh, these ones. Oh, there. Okay. Yeah. Oh, it's cost ones. Had to be awkward, didn't you, Dan? It had to be awkward. <laughs> That's two off there, so they're not a threat to me anymore. I'm not going to get Butcher's Bill this turn. There's no way. There's no way I'm killing two units. Doubt it. Well, you've got two 
two more squads left. Two more squads left. Okay, cool. Right then. So then uh, the other two, I just because th these can't come around and charge these anymore. So I'm done with them. So I'm gonna shoot this uh, blue unit. We need to kill something, don't you? Pretty damn big. Do, uh, do you think I'm gonna get it though? There's three scouts left. I'm, I'm not. I'm really not sure. I'm really not sure. But it just gives me the chance to go. I've killed ten guards. I, I just kill more. Well, I, I kind of made peace with the fact that you're gonna get kill something, kill more, and I'm probably not gonna get kill something anyway. Okay. okay. To, be, to be fair, killing them isn't that big. But then again, I suppose it leaves I'm, you. I'm it gives thinking, you. It leaves you a small unit to kill next. That's, time. I'm thinking for later turns. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what for butcher's bill and yeah, things. Yeah, yeah. That's what I was trying to think okay. of. Yeah, because you're probably gonna lose kill more anyway first. Turn. Exactly. I mean, it, it just means I'm gonna kill twenty guards when instead of ten. Okay. Which I'm sure yeah. you'll have no problem with whatsoever. I, do you know what? I'm gonna go for them. I'm gonna go for them. Oh, it, it's worth a point. Yeah, I'm gonna it's go still for worth it. a point. Okay. Oh yeah, kill, kill something is is still a point. That's, That's a good point. Yeah. yeah. Six, nine, ten. Yeah, so I'm, I'm trying to think of a head turn, so I should probably concentrate on getting points this turn if it's trap. Shall I? Yeah, you don't reroll twos and threes on these, do you? Yeah. There's two squads where I get full rerolls. Oh, right? sorry. Yeah, you have six orders, don't you? Yeah. You only ordered four squads of peasant boys. Correct. Four squads of peasant boys. Uh, one, two, three, four. Please. Three ups. There's another three dead. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get in. Just say they're dead until you move on. Yeah, right. yeah. Just say they're dead. Yeah. All right then. Well, there you I go. was not expecting that. Killed something. Butchers, butchers, <laughs> <Yeah>. butchers. <laughs> I was expecting like three wounds, then you go, oh, too fast. Yeah. I suppose you've got to try, right? Next you've got squad. to try for the butchers. Yeah. 12, 15 shots. Nice. Oh my god. It's yeah. going up and up and up. Butchers. Butchers. All fours. Pretty good. Guy. <laughs> well, you know, I, might, I should do that more often because they're. You can reroll once because you're Cadian. They pretty much are all fours. <laughs> Is every single one a four? One miss. Oh no! <laughs> Almost perfect. Oh, oh no, man! Oh my god! What the, what the hell, guys? Oh my god, man! That's so silly. That's so over average, man. <laughs> you do oh this for my pants, god! <laughs> Don't start that with me, Dan. Shut oh up, my man. god! Shut up. That's ridiculous. <laughs> I wish my voice was that deep. It's more squealy, curly. <laughs> seven. <laughs> Four, six, seven. So there's five, and then I'll reroll two of the passes. Six, seven. Two die. Oh no, man. You shouldn't have even killed one squad, and you've killed seven scouts. I wish I could have done that with some <laughs> drones the other way. Uh, which one? Is it another white scar squad, I'm guessing? Another white scar, because otherwise I'm. Oh no, I'm not minus to hit, am I? No, no, you're not minus to the Raven Guards. You could kill some Raven Guards. Oh, okay, then. Kill uh, the yeah, I'll well. go for these ones. Yeah. Close yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what I want to do. There we go. All right then, cool. Well, that wow. was that was event four. That was it? good, man. Oh, that was good. All right, cool. Uh, so that's me. That uh, means that gets me a point for recon. Uh, that gets me a point for kill something, and I get hold something. So three juicy points for me. Okay. <laughs> um. Oh, uh, actually, bro, I'm gonna spend one command point, uh -huh. and I'm gonna re-roll that chaplain roll because it's quite big, I think. Oh, okay, you're re-rolling this after all of your movement, yeah? It's only it's only on the chaplain himself, so it makes no difference to anyone else. What, what do you mean? He's make... just trying to get plus two on his own charge, not on anyone else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So that's quite big. Actually, no, I'm going to keep my CP. I think it's too much. Oh, I need that. I need that transhuman thing on them. Yeah, you can't, you can't re-roll <laughs> the chaplain thing. That's why I dropped chaplain. It's, it's too many CP. Yeah, that's true, actually. Too many CP. Okay, psychic phase. So, I need these powers. Now, now I'm going to feel your pain, Dan. Now I'm going to feel your pain. I'm going to put no 
Overwatch on that guy, <laughs> and this is huge now. Yes, on a seven with the mm -hmm. plus one. Mm -hmm. Where's the Libby? Just here. So, so on a seven? Twelve, yeah. Yeah. I stayed within eleven of the wall. Oh, I'll let you. I'll let you. So uh, <laughs> then we'll watch, and then plus two advance and charge. Yep. I think I'm gonna put that on these scouts right here. Yeah. I have a plan. Yes, on a ten. Yep. Cool. Uh, I believe that's all my powers. Yes. Okay. Shooting phase. Nice and quick. It's really nice and quick. Two, four, six, eight. Eight D six flamers on them. On the guardsmen. Yep. Yeah, they're dead, mate. There you go. <laughs> they go down. <laughs> Auto-hitting as well. <laughs> it's good, isn't it? Daka, daka. It's good. And then, and then I'm going to throw a crack grenade from my uh, Raven Guard Smash Captain. Crack a grenade? Yeah, at the unit of red custodes. The one that he can charge. Yeah. Alright. The unit of red custodes. Hits. Does. Four plus. Wounds on a five. Dice, please. Three plus. Three plus. Bushuk! Oh. I just grenade. need one wound. Or moon. Oh, yeah. Because he's, th he's only got three damage armor. <laughs> yeah. So I was like, as long as I can get one through with a crack grenade, he's actually <laughs> going to do something meaningful. Yeah. yeah. And then he's going to do the same thing on this squad. <laughs> he's going to throw one crack grenade. Oh, I got, I got this guy. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, he advanced, mate. I thought white squads could do that. Do what? Advance and shoot and charge. No. Only aggressors. Can... Yeah, only, oh, only okay. aggressors. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, where did, that, where did that first grenade come from? Him. He advanced as well, right? <coughs> oh, damn, yeah, all these guys <laughs> advanced. They could just advance and charge, right? Oh, no. Oh, that sucks. Damn. Trying to do one wound on him. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, then. Um, I can do it from that guy. They advanced as well. Oh my one. god! Everyone's advancing. One. Oh yeah. <laughs> what is going on? Yeah. Okay. Fair. Can't shoot. Can't shoot. None of them guys can shoot anyway. Dave shot. Just thunderfires. Oh, this is a cool, quick army. This is nice. First, first squad of thunderfires. Uh, we'll fire at the the red squad of guardsmen. Okay. Um, the red squad of guardsmen. Mm -hmm. Why? What's your plan here? Why are you trying to kill Red Red Guards? You find out. Um. Yeah. Okay. I'll take cover. I'll play your game. Three. So that takes shots. me down to um, eight. I think. Six shots. Hitting on twos. Five hits. Uh, Master Artisans. Just five hits. Uh, and then wounding on threes. No, is it strength six or strength five? Uh, I think it's strength five. And then re-rolling one with artisans. Three. Is it a hit or wound? Or hit and hit wound? Hit and wound. Is it? Yeah. Nice, that's good. Um, so you're minus two, right? Yes. So five uh, ups. So five ups. Oh. Three dead. I'm glad that you wasted your CP. Yep. Glad. I'm really glad that you wasted that Tasty. CP. Okay. That's on the red guard one. And then... Okay. Yeah. Uh, and then I will go on the Grey Guardsman. I totally screwed up my psychic phase. <laughs> I put no overwatch on the unit that can't be overwatched. They're charging through a wall. You put no overwatch on him, right? Oh yes, I did. P plus two to oh, plus two advance and charge. Oh yes, now I remember my plan. <laughs> Yeah, that was the way I was supposed to do it, and I thought I did it the other way around, and I was like, have I just done the wrong powers? Or the wrong? No. Cheers, Dan. You remember. The Grey Squad. Second Thunder Fire. Six shots? Oh, I think I just realised what this plan is. <laughs> I'm in on this plan now. All hit. Yeah. Threes. With artisans. Five. Six ups. Three down. White squad, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Okay. And then the, the third one, we'll go on the white squad again. Yeah. Six shots. 
Oh my god, I'm rolling constantly under average with this, Dan. Oh my god. Oh my god. You'll be happy to know. <laughs> Six hits. Threes. Oh, nice. Didn't even need artisans. All six wound. All six? Yep. White squad. Gone. Dead. That was the third one, right? Yep. Yep. And... What kind of a thing have I done there? Three of the red are gone, aren't they? So yeah, I've got a lot more red to kill. Probably won't because they've got five ups as well. Yep. Blues or greens. Blues or greens. Um, blues or green. No, I don't want to kill blues or greens. There's a plan for them. Uh, I'm going to fire my thunder fire again. On the red squad. Okay. Down to five. It's two command points, isn't it? Yep. More than six shots. Twelve. That'll do. Damn. Well, I rolled six, six, six. So, and they should have been eight, eight, eight. So I should have got six extra shots, and here they are. Look at that. It all averages out, Dan. It all averages out. Ten hit per average. Artisans. Eleven. <laughs> Threes. Artisans. Slightly above average. I'll take it, mate. These so, five my ups. stays will be just above average, so it's fine. Oh, they were! Two, three, three. Seven dead. Oh, that's the squad. Wicked. <laughs> Is that over average? <laughs> you know. <laughs> just, just trying to make you feel better. <laughs> yeah, I killed the one that you buffed. How does that feel? <laughs> <laughs> and I think that's my turn, bro. Seven. Right, okay, then my turn, yeah? <laughs> yeah. Uh, you all heard it. <laughs> I've got that on record, no, mate. No tape backs. <laughs> I don't like to play my game with tape backs. Touch move. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, charges then, I believe, bro. I think I'm onto charges, right? Shot everyone that's allowed to shoot. The chaplain will shoot, charge the guardsman behind the wall. See if he can make it without his plus two. A seven. Is he within eight inches of that guardsman? I'd say quite easily. Probably believe so. Yeah, I had to, I basically, I moved all my guardsmen back here. I had to put one up against the wall, because I wanted to be out of charge range. But um, I had to move one over here to get recon, unfortunately. Yeah, he'll run through the wall. So. Guardsman. Yep. And the scouts will do the exact same thing. That unit of three dangerous scouts. Sacrifice. Six inches? Six inches. Probably within seven, I hope, of that one guy. He's right in the corner, isn't he? Oh, that's close. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you yeah. are. Awesome. Um, my smash captain that can't be overwatched is going to be the sacrificial lamb. He's going to charge these two squads. Oh, he's just going to charge all three squads. That's a purple, right? That's a red, and that's a... Yeah, you've got purple, red, gold. Yeah, he's going to charge all three. You can go where you want. So what's he in base with all of them? Is he within an inch of all of them? Yeah, it? within an inch of all of them. Yeah. Okay, cool. It's so that you can't counter charge. Yeah. Because that's huge. Yeah. I don't mind if you counter charge with him, because he probably won't kill me with mm -hmm. five attacks. But if you counter charge with a squad and got 12 attacks, mm -hmm. before I struck, it would yeah. kill me. That was, that was my plan. Yeah, yeah. That's why I was keeping them I all together, so, yeah. waiting for you to do it. Yeah. That's why if I if I failed no overwatch, mm -hmm. that was the plan. The plus two inch charge, charge them in first, then get him in. Yeah, that, that, like when you were killing these, I was like, oh, okay, he's going to charge the scouts in, so then I can't... Overwatch. So then I oh, can't... Oh, so you can't So then that, I can't... Yeah. Swoop and dive, it's yeah, called. Yeah, yeah, yeah. swoop and dive me. That was, that, was the that was the plan. So that's when you started killing them. I was like, oh, he's going to stop my swoop and dive. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> he's going to declare all of them, just in case he gets lucky and kills a squad in his first go. Cool. Unlikely, but still. Five. So he will go uh, here. I suppose that's three purple there. So that's a purple base. That's a red base. Mm -hmm. So he will stand basically where this guy's bike is. Like that. Uh, these scouts here uh -huh. will charge. Actually, the Raven Guard ones that didn't advance will charge the blue squad. Nine inches. 
Have you used any CP yet, man? You have, haven't you? Yeah, I used two for Thunderfire. So I'm just thinking about... Uh, do, I roll, I roll, do I roll two dice? No, one. Again? It's one for every strategy. For every strategy. No. It's uh, every command point for your Warlord trait on yourself, yeah, if you want it. Okay. So, I want to hold more. How many do you... You're holding one, because I should kill them. Yeah. So I should be I should be holding two, and you should be holding... Oh, yeah, I should be holding two, and you should be holding one. So I don't really need anyone over here, is what I'm yeah. thinking. Well, actually, I mean... I might as well link back with my charge, right? Because there's no harm in it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, let's do that. Uh, all, uh, the the all-important one. The Centurions into the blue squad and the green squad. Mm -hmm. Eight. Eight inches. It's quite easily, I'd say. Right. Am I in nine? Oh, yeah. I'm in eight. So they can move eight inches this way. And they need to go three inches down, five inches across. Basically five inches from here. It's not going to be very far. It's going to have to chain. It's going to have to be somewhere five inches from the wall. That. Uh. Cool. Uh, then these white scars ones are going to charge into the blues. Uh, seven plus two, nine. I'm not declared. Custodis? Well, within six of the smash people anyway. But can my custodies not just pile into you and attack you anyway? Yeah, That's what you want to do. If you don't want to hit the smash weapon, then yeah. Uh, these scouts will not charge? Oh no, I should charge, just in case. I'm gonna charge. Uh -huh. He charging? No, just Okay. Okay, I think everybody made their charge. Perfect. Cool. Uh, I will swoop and dive. Okay. So that's three command points. Yeah. Oh, I'm just thinking. Five? I'm just thinking. Even maybe if I get two through, you'll probably use a CP because I can roll a five on yeah. two D three. Yeah. So I'm just. It's trying to make you burn through your CP. Oh yeah. You yeah, need yeah, them yeah. more than me, right? That's it. It might be worth it. You never know. Mm. Okay then, so it's he's he's not flat four is he? But he is. Mm -hmm. So it's whether I go after him or him. They both got three of inventory, right? But he's toughness five. He's toughness four. Makes no difference to me. Mm -hmm. Yep. Has he got more wounds? Who? Sorry, the bike guy. Yes, six. Uh, okay. So I'm better off coming over here after him, aren't I? After the raven going on, yeah. And the Raven God wants four damage. He's yeah. the one that's going to kill bikes exactly. flat. Yeah. Nine inches. Ooh. Uh. How also, many bro, attacks do I get? Uh, just because it makes no difference. Yeah. Uh, just because they were in 12 of those bikes, yeah. I'll just declare them. Because they can't overwatch me anyway. Uh, who? who uh, the, the Centurion. Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah, they'll just declare them anyway. Just because it makes no difference. Sure. No one could have overwatched them. Okay, alright, uh, so see, so I get five attacks with him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep, yep. Uh, do they get the new Angels of Death thing? I don't think so, no. Oh, it would have been nice to have six attacks with him. Yeah. So oh, could you imagine five attacks on every bike? That, that's four ones, so I'm, I'm, glad, <gasps> I'm glad I'm rerolling. <laughs> if you get another one, that's just <laughs> silly. That's literally just silly. No, no, okay, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> now it's threes, with, and I know you're worse with threes with the rerolls than you are with twos with yeah, Tell so. me about it. Oh, it's only one, mate. It's only one. I'm changing dice. Changing dice. God damn it! <laughs> 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 I just can't do a three of reroll. Four, mate. Four, Come on, three, two of these. plus three plus. Uh, 
Ugh. He's okay, he doesn't fail any. Ugh. That was worth mm. a try. Yeah. Oh, uh, I expected him to fail one. Yeah. I expected him to fail one. So. I don't even know. Okay. So, uh, yes, yeah, so you get to do that first. Then it's my go. And you will probably interrupt. Yes, I will. So I will go with that smash, Captain. Uh -huh. So he has four attacks plus one. That's it, I'm guessing. Five yeah, you didn't put anything there. else special on him, did you? No. Nope. Uh, so five attacks, uh, and he's going to hit the purple squad. Yep. El Purpel. One miss. I need more twos than that. El Purpel. Oh, you jerk. Four wounds. Prick. Four wounds. Okay. okay. You can fail three this four ups cool, out man. of this. Come on, guys. You got this. <laughs> It'd be pretty what, funny. Easy if you four did. ups. Oh, well, th that one's cocked, but that's already three failed anyway. No way! Yep. Oh, wow. Yep, there's all, there's all four <laughs> failed, just just for the hell of it. Dong, 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 da dong, dong. <laughs> He's just killed three. Oh, no. I would have used a CP oh, no. to reroll one of the... Yeah, like, if it, if it, if was, I was, if like, it was, if was a three dead. I was like, if I fail two, and then I reroll one, you should kill one guy. Ah! Yeah. No! <laughs> no! <coughs> so, yeah, That's pretty so, rough. Yeah, that so is pretty rough. I will interrupt then. Fight you with Red oh, Squad? Oh, uh, sorry. Uh, just one thing. Yeah. Because I think this does matter. So he will consolidate, of course. Sure. Why would it matter? Because he can consolidate three inches this way. Okay. And then Red Squad just can't hit him. No, Red Squad are going to hit this guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it means you have to hit that guy. Okay. <laughs> So, um, I'm not quite sure. Because I need to try and keep him safe from the battle cannons. Mm -hmm. The problem is, he's already fought, right? And he didn't declare these? Yeah. So, what does it matter? Why would I ever go for him? I'd go oh for no, he declared guy. red and purple, remember? Oh, That's he? why he went into the gap where the I moved the bike and put him into the gap oh, space okay. and two squads. Okay. So. Actually, yeah, fighting again could be quite big with him. So, yeah, he probably will just jump to there. And ba base this red bike. This one bike. That's okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's well me. Then. Well, I'll interrupt the reds and punch him then. Okay. <laughs> if so, that's the case. Uh, down to three command points? Yeah. Oh, no, actually. Oh, yeah, you're like four inches away. What's up? Let's go. Cool. Two command points. No, because um, custodies have a have a, a one CP interrupt if a unit is within three inches of an objective. You can oh, interrupt with one CP. Yeah, it's huge, man. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh. Basically, I thought you were within three inches of it because you knew mm -hmm. it. So I thought you were going to double interrupt. Uh, interrupt with two CP, interrupt with one CP, and fight with both squads first. Oh. Well, yeah, if I'd known about that stratagem, then yeah, that would have been I think amazing. You could, I think you can fight with both I've, squads first, I've right? Ne I've, never, I've never heard that stratagem before in my life. I've never seen anyone use that. Well, just let's, <laughs> sh let's show people the power of it. There you go. Let's say they're in. Are you sure you can do that? Do you want to have a look? I know you can do it, but I, I don't know if you can double interrupt. How does that work? Do, would it go one for you, it one for me, one for you It completely depends how it's worded. So you know how the interrupt's worded, right? So the custody book I have right here. And they definitely do. It's called Something Guardians. I suppose whenever I've played a custody, anything that's gone near them has just died anyway. Yeah. Remember I used this. Something Guardians. Or it's not called Something Guardians. Indomitable Guardians. 1CP, use this stratagem in your opponent's fight phase after an enemy unit that charged has fought. Choose an Adeptus Custodes unit from your army that's within 3 inch of an objective marker and fight with it next. Oh, so you've got to use them after an enemy unit that charged has fought. And then you have to use the other one after an enemy unit that charged has fought. Uh, don't check you? it, get the rule book. Well, I'll use that one. and then Use this I'll one, it's only one command point. I'll roll that. Uh, yeah, I'll use that one and then you have a look at the, how so the other ones put work. Put you back up to 4. <laughs> I've just okay. taken 1 off you instead okay. of 2. God, Dad, you don't even know the army you're using. <laughs> and no one has ever used that in front of me. All uh, right, so uh, was it th uh, three attacks each I get, right? Four, bro. Four attacks each. Nice. How mad is that? They only get one less than the captain. It's yeah, crazy, isn't it? pretty silly. But I'm not re-rolling to 
hit here, am I? Yeah, no, not really running to wound, sorry. No, no, oh, no, no, because I charged you. She's running on threes. Oh, man, that's a lot of wounds. Oh, oh, no. It's not that far off average, but just think with all of those, I probably just kill him. Uh, seven, mate. What, you don't want to kill him? No, I was just if I was rerolling wounds, instead of seven, it would have been... Eleven. <laughs> and eleven is like three going through. Him with the reroll, I could still punk his ass. Seven, right? Seven. Seven. On the bike. No, oh. on him. Oh, on, on, oh, on Mr. Main, dude. Does fail too. <laughs> this is this is what I wanted the shield captain to do. <laughs> oh no, I think this is what I want. Yeah, I think this is what I want. Go for it. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Oh. Oh. No. <laughs> okay, so he's got two command points left. Ah, uh, two two wounds. Oh, that's that's still good that he's alive. My master plan was for you to kill him. <laughs> My master plan was to kill him. I wanted to fight again with him when he died, huh? kill as many of Red Squad as I could, mm -hmm. and then um, Centurions are obviously going to um, kill the Green Squad, yeah. consolidate into the building, yeah. pay three command points to fight again, and hit that last Custode Squad. Uh -huh. So I was hoping to damage all three squads. Yeah, but I needed you to kill him for that. Because I need him to strike again, and him to strike, and then I should kill one squad. Basically, you know the first one that I killed the whole of? Obviously that shouldn't happen. <laughs> so basically, so. <laughs> you're trying to table me in the first turn, Manny. Is what you're trying no, no, to... I'm going to leave you with three tank Stop commanders, it. mate. Stop it. Leave no. me alone. Obviously going to leave you with three tank commanders. I'm not leave that Leave me horrible. alone. <laughs> you're a bully, that's what you are. <laughs> <laughs> mate, when you go back in your turn, you're going to oh, smack man. everything on the board really hard. Uh, right, okay. So hang on. What? Not if I haven't got any bloody custodian <laughs> bikes left, I won't. Uh, mate, I, d I don't know where these stratagems are. The stratagems? Yeah. They should be in, in the rules book. Like, yeah, yeah, there they are. Oh, there they are. <laughs> See, I, mate, I glance at the screen and they're there. Yeah, of course. <laughs> right. Counter effect. This stratagem is used right after an enemy unit that charged has fought. Select one of your own, Alabjorn. So it's, well, it's, it says it's used right after. Yeah, so I reckon you can use both of them at the same time. Why can't you? You, you just use them both right after my, my unit is fought. I suppose. I mean, I'm, I'm Surely, and you like, just double the, interrupt. The problem is, like, the, in the order of operations, because it's your turn, you would decide in which order I do that. But that makes no difference, right? No. You just go, okay, I'll fight with this one first then. And then I just go, no, you have to fight with that one first. And you go, okay, cool. I'll still fight with both of them. Surely, right? But obviously, if you want to up to you if you want to fight with the second one because that the next one exactly would have to go what two guys into him yeah. and then one is by the scouts anyway so he he can't like exactly move there's, anywhere. Not, there's not much i can do now anyway right mm. it's not like i can put anything into him which is what i would need to do yeah exactly because he's the one on two wounds so i can fight with two guys into him is that worth two command points probably isn't gonna kill you down to two if you do that yeah, I'd just better off having them together, isn't it? You're on four, I'm on five. That's just not worth it. Probably not, bro. But interesting to know. Interesting. Yeah, yeah, I just thought I'd... Because that's, that's big, right? So yeah, guys, yeah, there yeah. you go. You can double interrupt with I, 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 I've never, I've never seen anyone do that. That's yeah. really cool. Okay, go for it. I have to admit, I've never done them both. Yeah. But I've, I have used the... I, I always use the interrupt with one oh, seat. Okay. That's oh. why I knew you could do it for one. What's well, so the advantage of playing something that you haven't seen for ages? <laughs> no one knows their yeah. strategy. There's so many new strategies come out since, right? Yeah. Okay, so you're not going to interrupt now, so I know that much. So I'm going to be cheeky here. They're going to try and take one wound off him so that he can... His hammer can kill one. Yeah. <laughs> um, oh, actually, no, because I want the Centurions to get into there. Okay, let's do this in the right order. Uh, these scouts into the blue squad. Okay. So how many attacks do they get? Everyone's got combat blades. Is that three attacks each? Yes. Two, three. And the sergeant four. gets four. Sergeant gets four. So that's the three guys, and then sergeant one. How many do you want? Three. Two, three. Four. There we go. Man, that's 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 a crazy number of attacks, man. So hitting on threes. It's actually what marines should be though. It feels it feels right, you know, when you add one attack to. 
<laughs> Marines, yeah, but not scouts. I think they're rerolling ones anyway. So threes. Yeah, they're only twos. Nine? God, that's a bit mental. Nine. Combat blades don't minus one, are they? They just plus one attack. So five ups. I'll make two. So two, four, six, seven dead. Mm -hmm. Into blues. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Two, four, six. Um, no, actually, I'm doing that wrong, aren't I? I should be taking blues off from this side. Put them back. Two, four, six, seven. Mm -hmm. okay. Yep. And then they're gonna they're gonna swing into within one inch of your custodes. Okay. Just because why not? Uh, then these Raven Guard ones. So need to see how many attacks I'm gonna lose here. Hopefully it's just three. That guy. Awesome. Yeah. So uh, these three guys will fight, yeah. and then this guy's within an inch of them, yeah. and then this player has to be over here. So one guy's not fighting. I can't believe you've There's got the majority of your two. army in reserve. I have no idea how I'm going to clear what's on the board. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's mental, isn't it? This is a hard game for me. If you forget about your reserves, you just doing four. Give some dice. What is wrong? Uh, that's five, six dice. It's mental. That feels like that should be the whole squad, roughly. That's three attacks less. That's crazy. I suppose, yeah, it is Marines. It, it's, I think it's, it's it is a good Marines, ability. It's what Marines it is should be, man. Oh my god. <laughs> Three wounds. I might kill the squad. So. Oh, two guys. Kills two guys. Is this blue squad again? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ugh. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, then I've got my uh, El Centurion, Cent Centuriones. Right there, and then this guy can be within an inch of him. This guy can be within an inch of him. And this guy. Awesome. So everyone's going to fight the greens. So they have four attacks each, I believe. Two, three, and the sergeant needs five, and then four dice. I think so, anyway. That's, surely that's right, isn't it? Oh, Hitting on threes, but they don't suffer any minus. We're all in the ones with their captain. Okay. They've got, got three miss. attacks each base. Nice. Yeah, plus off charge. So all of them miss. Twos. Oh, wow. No way. Look at that. Oh, uh, sorry. Uh, the Master Artisan's a hit roll. Still misses. And then Master, Master Artisan's a wound roll. Yeah. Forgetting about Master Artisan's, man. Three, so. six, nine. Nine dead. Nine dead. Yeah. Greens. Mm -hmm. Right. So if I leave this guy over here, mm -hmm. does that mean you can't get into him then, can you? Yeah, one can, but is they it just got to get within an inch of him? Basically, I think I think one can. And this uh, one guy can hop the wall to get in an inch of him. Yeah. But I don't think these two can. So I think I'll get two centuries. That's going to be worth it, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Two instead of four. Yeah. Definitely worth it. I don't, I don't know if I'd spend three command points to only fight with two, exactly. do you know what I mean? Yeah. 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 It'd, it'd be a big waste then, wouldn't it? Yeah. Okay. Oh, man. So, uh, and then co consolidate. Well, in uh, oh. first round of LGT, I thought I did really well against my opponent. In to a um, base then. I've surrounded the last guardsman in case you want to keep him alive for two <laughs> command points. <laughs> and my first round opponent, I killed like eighty of it, all eighty nice. of his guardsmen that were screening, and I thought I did really well. <laughs> you've just you've just killed sixty guardsmen just for the crack of it with half your army in reserve. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to try to kill one of these, I think, and I'll be happy with this turn. Because then I've killed three bikes, right? 
Is that guy just spare? Is that a guy there? His base has been taken off. His bike's still there. Is he purple? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's purple. <laughs> Trying to keep extra guys. Oh, is that how desperate no. you get in, Dan? <laughs> it looks a lot better. Put it, put it back. <laughs> put it back. The green guys are going to hit him. <laughs> Come on. Come on, greens. Just take one wound off him. We're all in ones with the captain that's next to them. Still a one, of course. And then wounding on a five plus. Of course, because you roll so many ones. One, two, three, four, five, six. You should roll a one here, mate. You should roll a one here. Nah. Not happening. Got white scars. <laughs> Bushak! Oh yes! Oh. Now the El Capitan, the El Capitan should kill him. That's what I'm aiming for. I just want one bite. I just want one bite. Oh yeah, that's probably the best. <laughs> Come on, smash Cappy, on his bike. Twos, five hits. No, it's not twos. Ones. Three wounds. Hopefully, you can fail one. Oh. I found one. Okay. Is that worth a CP? Is that worth a CP, Manny? Hmm. Okay. So that means you don't kill any of them. I would then... say no. Okay. Because, just because, I'm going to spend three command points to fight. Yeah. The only decision is, if you leave, if you reroll that and leave him alive, yeah. I'll fight with them. And it will be five, nine attacks. Yeah. But if you let him die, I'll have to fight with him twice. And then that's only... He might kill one. <laughs> what do you mean, might kill one? He's, one just, kill, he's just killed yeah, the squad. Because he failed everything. Because <laughs> right? he failed everything. He, he, he should kill one <sighs> slash two, but I don't know how many they kill with nine attacks. That's true. So. But you, what, you don't think you can get him... Oh, no, you can't actually, because that guardsman's over there. Yeah, I'd, I'd probably be able to get this guy. Oh no no because I only charged them. I didn't charge the reds. Okay. So no. Go on then. I'll I'll go with follow your lead. Okay. Uh, four bikes down already. So I would let him I would let him die because I don't know how many they kill with all those extra attacks. Um You tell me, is this worth it? Is this is it worth three command points for one Smash Captain fighting? It probably is, isn't it, if I can kill like two bikes. Yeah, I mean, they're 100 points each. It's huge. Yeah, I'll go down to two command points. Oh, hang on, I haven't fought yet, have I? With them. Oh, no, you haven't yet. Okay, then. Uh, so, I'm going to... I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to fight them both into... Um, green squad. Yeah. Because then that gets me on my butcher's bill, right? Do you uh, kill, kill you that, two units in a turn? turn? Oh, okay. Not so a battle round. Not a battle yeah, round. Yeah, I think it's a turn. So if you were to kill the Smash Captain, then yeah. What? If you were to kill the Smash Captain... Where? Like, uh, when you, when you like, hit him, then, because yeah. he's down to two wins, then, it, then you would have got Butchers for killing the Scouts now as well. Because then you would have killed both of them in, in your own turn. Oh, like, I see what you mean, right, yeah, yeah. 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 It's two, it's, I think it's two in any one turn. In whether one it's in your turn or my oh, turn, see, yeah, doesn't yeah. matter. I think. Okay, I was thinking maybe it's battle round. Okay, then. Uh, yeah, because I just think he's got a three-up in run, and I'm not doing anything. Um, right, okay then. Yeah, so I get four attacks each, right? Mm -hmm. So I'll go, um, I'll go him into the blues and him into the greens, and then okay. that gives me an easy butcher spell next turn. Next turn. Okay, so one into the blues. Uh, so that's two dead. Yep. And then into the greens. Four dead. Oh, very nice. <laughs> it's brilliant. My casualties so far are 10 scouts. You killed more in my turn than you did in uh, your own turn. Yeah. How mentally... Oh, no! These scouts are now dead. Yeah. I better take them off before yeah, I really forget them later on. Yeah, they are. No, that's 13 scouts, mate. You've almost killed half my scouts. I don't like that. They're my favourite They're my favorite units in the army. Okay, so, yeah, fighting with him again. Uh -huh. So he's hitting on 3+. Plus, and I totally forgot this, and I wanted to roll a 2 to show you Master Artisans. Hits. Totally forgot I got Master Artisans. 
And then three's to wound. Or five. Oh, okay, that that's that's really good. <laughs> that's actually really good. Oh man, that smash captain with the rerolls to hit wound. <laughs> bonkers. Man. Yeah, he's mental. Four ups. No. Is it only three then? Four. Oh, it's four. That's he's killed two squads. Oh my! Hey, mate, he's killed six hundred points this turn. <laughs> Oh my god! Wow. Just wow. Well, this is why I don't play custodies because I can't make a forum to save my life. <laughs> <laughs> you, you know why he's killed him? Oh my god! <laughs> Dan, uh. what a guy! <laughs> <laughs> what, what a guy! guy. <laughs> that is that is the ace river. Look, and he's just game. just relaxing. Look at him. He's his hands like <laughs> what a what guy! A guy. <laughs> uh, so I think that's it. Seven custodes. Without without them, is pretty big, I think. <laughs> pretty. Well, he's killed six on his own. He's killed six on his own. Oh, mate. Yeah, he is definitely worth it. Uh, the chaplain? Yeah. I think it's four attacks now. Normally he has three or something. He's failed loads. He hits on twos in combat, right? Chaplain? Yeah, or chaplain, will you? Uh, and then one master artisans. Three hits. Uh, winning on twos against guardsmen because strength six isn't it, Crozius? Master artisans. Three wounds. Uh, three three wounds. wounds. Is it minus one for Crozius? Minus two, I think. Oh, then it just kills three, doesn't it? Yeah, don't wanna. And then uh, one, two, three scouts. Yeah, I'm just thinking if I take them off, it doesn't make any difference, does it? Because you'll still get to pile in three. Three, yeah. And then you'll be within an inch of someone who can fight and all that mm, kind of stuff. Yeah. Okay, then. Yeah, go on. Yep, and then uh, obviously all I'm going to do is move the scouts in front of the chaplain, right? And, uh, I'm only going to attack with one down, and then I'm going to wrap that guard in uh, with the rest. Oh, no, I'm not, because your objective secured over here, aren't you? Bit of custodes. So why you I'm going to fight with all of them. Well, I was going to say, how you can't fight with just the one. Yeah, yeah, I was just going to leave two back and then consolidate to where they are now. But I think I'm just going to hit with all of them. Okay. Because uh, I've, I'm on two. Yeah. But he, he's obsec. I forgot mm. he's obsec. Yeah, sure. I remember. Just in time. Uh, they're Raven Guard, aren't they? Yeah. Artisans. The Artisans is good. I like it. it it's huge on him. Rerolling a two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rerolling yeah. a two is huge. Yeah, I didn't think how good it would be on a. Bloody hell, look at that. I didn't realise how good it would be on a Smash Captain. Those scouts want it. There's only three of them. That's because they're angry that you kill their pals. Is oh, it dead? <laughs> angry that you kill their pals, mate. Oh! No. Really angry that you kill their pals. Alright then, so I'll fight with three guys into your scouts. Nothing. Uh, is there anything cool I can do with whatever I've got left here? Have you based this guy? Which guy, sorry? This green guy? Oh yeah, this side and that side and this side. Okay then. Blue guy's based as well. And obviously the grey guy. And then the grey guy's based. Mm. Everyone's based, so I can't even do anything. Right then, well, white and blue will punch that scout squad. Mm hmm Nothing. And then that guy there will punch a centurion in the back of the head. <laughs> No. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, oi, bang! <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, that was a pretty insane turn one. Yeah. Without having anything... Going second and not having my main hard hitters on the board. <sighs> I think these are my only two hard hitters. These two. On the board. And that's what? 160... 170 uh -huh. points roughly and 160 it's about 300 points so 300 I points mean all my guys auto die right those crazy. three there yeah, all of the guards are auto die yeah. uh, morale on your scout uh, yeah he's a sergeant so, so what uh, four plus uh, five plus he's dead three okay these guys here you kill five of their friends no sorry there's three left so you kill seven seven so their leadership seven so they're going to lose uh, what that's good I'll that the guy that's wrapped in there yep it just means I've got three on the objective, so it's my objective. Yeah, I've, I've only got two guys there. Yeah, yeah. And then, uh, and yeah, then the grey dies, the blue dies, and the green dies. <laughs> well, I mean, if you took Butcher's Bill, you'd have pretty much nailed it. 
Yeah. I'm annoyed that I, I left you with some guardsmen alive. <laughs> Why? That's pretty mental, isn't it? Okay. Uh, right then. So what do you? Oh, do you hold on. Didn't then? the didn't the chaplain kill three? And the guardsmen, ki uh, the scouts kill six. six. Nine. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so that guy should just pop. <laughs> oh, sorry, mate. I don't know. I don't know how many there are. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah the, did, did the chaplain, chaplain kill three? Because he got three hits with his reroll oh, the answers. Oh, we thought he was minus then, two anyway. Oh yeah, yes, he did, yes, he, did, he yeah, just yeah. killed three. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, I'm miscounting. No, that's right. Um, um, and yeah, that's it. I think. Oh, that's like that one guardsman that I, oh, I, I tried so hard to cheat because he was yeah. going to win me the game. <laughs> yeah. You know what? Right. You thought that was bad. You <laughs> thought that was bad. You know it would have been worse uh, if I did take snares. That bike squad would have been locked. Yeah. And then you would have literally been able to do nothing. I think turn two. How mental is that? Whew. Even my scouts would have been safe then. <laughs> one, three man and one one. <laughs> okay, so you got you got kill so something. Let's count these points. You got kill something, kill more. Hold, hold something, something, hold, hold more. more. You've maxed out gangbusters. You've maxed out. You've got three points on Reaper. And I've got an old school. And you've got an old school. Wow. So that's what four, five, six, seven, eight, and four, twelve points. <laughs> 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 one, two, three, four. One, two, three. One. Oh my god. Twelve points. Well, I did say, didn't I, right? If you go first, this will probably be the shortest battle report that we've ever done. And you've gone second and still achieved that. <laughs> wow. I mean, like, there, was no, there was no list tailoring or anything really that went on here. No. Uh, this was just, I kind of put a cool cool army that you could see at a tournament yeah and um... the thing is it just depends now if you if you move I think you'd have to move 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 all the mortars I think if you move move moved all the mortars and made a screen move the tank commanders back a bit and your custodies out of there and you could probably kill one unit of centurions and the two smash captains if you could do that how the hell would I do that with the tank commander you All can't, the you, they won't die. The Centurions and the two Smash Captains won't no, die No, I, think, I think these three will kill the Smash Captain. That's got two rooms left with Hurricane Bolt and 36 shots. Yeah. So they should probably kill him. So you've got to kill one Smash Captain and four Centurions, I think. And then it's just all up to my reserves and whether I can make charges when I come down on them and all of that kind of stuff. But I, th I think if you don't manage to kill those Centurions, it's probably over, man. Which is a bit insane, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. I'll tell you what. Let's not. Let's not. Let's not stop the recording, because it's, it's not exactly going to take me long, is it? So these guys, oh, yeah. I can. <laughs> I'll stop the recording. I only move. On. I can only move them like you know four point nine yeah. because I need the double shooting, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It would have actually been quite nice if your um, if your one guardsman punched the sentry in the head, because then the hammer of Sundrans would have just gone <laughs> <Yeah>. one dead. <laughs> uh, right, okay then. So this squad here, this one, move and run. This is nine inches. This is what we call playing for points. This oh, um, here. because it's the start of the battle round. I've got to see if my chaplain thing works. Yep. Nope. Told you. <laughs> Tried to warn you, didn't I? Yeah. But he's just a bonus character for me, isn't he, really? Mate, you've spent like 90 points on him. But I, I need one, right? I need a second character no. for my Raven God. Oh, you could take so much better. <laughs> uh, these squad here. Yeah, quite obviously, I could take another one of him that's just gone round butchering everyone. <laughs> I can't believe that. I actually can't believe it. Uh, these guys here. I'll run him there. <laughs> Uh, just throw it in six of him, and then these guys. I actually can't believe the amount of damage that these these, these Raven Guard can do. 
these have to be within 12, don't they, for the bolters to work? Yes. For the rapid fire. I need that character to be closer to Dim than that scout. Yeah, okay, that's fine. So th these are all still closer to him than that guy there. Yep. Right then, okay, so then um, I'm going to move, move, move these quarters. This one. Oh, hang on, I've got my assassin. Assassin! Where can he come? Uh, I want him. There? Oh, no, I basically want to stop. I want him to interrupt your. Um, oh, stop these guys doing something. Like the deep strike, basically. Oh, yes! I want, uh, he's, he's just another bubble, isn't he? For he's your deep just strike, another bubble, effectively. yeah. Effectively. Yeah. Oh. It depends where you want to move, move, move your mortars to, right? Yeah, because I mean, well, they're just going to go as far forward as they can. Yeah, that way. So you'll have I'm thinking if I bring him down over here, uh, within range of your scouts. Oh yeah, to charge the scouts and the charge the scouts, try and kill them, and make a bubble in the middle and then, where I can't and deep then stand strike. there, and then you can't deep strike around there. Yeah, and then push out the mortars as far yeah. as they'll go. Yeah. Bloody glue snapped on him. I can't keep that guy in his base no matter what I do. Alright, these mortars here. Five. Eleven. They go eleven. Yeah, I think I, uh, I think I'm enjoying using Marines. <laughs> <laughs> this is wow. why people are having so much fun. You wow, know? this is why people are having That's so much crazy. fun. The, the amount of things they can just do. <coughs> I mean, I wouldn't even even think about you know engaging custodes with my with my Tau like at all. You just can't like. <laughs> There you go, there's my little bubble that I've made. So there, everyone's out, out of three of him, mate. Yep, but obviously we're within three of him. Yeah, because he should die. Because he's going to die! <laughs> you, do uh, know he, you do know he won't now, don't you? <laughs> like, you do know that. Right then, so, custodies. Four, six, seven, eight, two, four. So, custody shooting at your, your bike, Captain. Uh, oh, and an extra one there. You have another one there, you can reroll as well. Red one. Oh, I'm loving how accurate these are. Yeah, this, uh, the re hitting on twos rerolls is really good. <laughs> really good. Okay, man. So, fours. Yeah. I don't think you should have moved him into the middle of the board as quickly as you did. Well, I because th I thought if I put all the guardsmen there, that's just what you should have done. <coughs> I thought, yeah, I put the guardsmen there because I thought I want them on terrain. So then next turn I can spread out as far as I can. But then I thought I'll put the guardsmen there and then put them behind. Because I was like, if you send, because your smash captains can reach me wherever, unless I'm like right over the back here. 
<coughs> so I yeah. thought, oh, he's, he'll probably come in with with a smash captain. But then I was like, I'll swoop in dive him. Yeah. I didn't expect you to commit both the smash captains. This but was, I'll be honest with you, because a... I was like, if I was like, if he fights, like he might kill two, but then I'll CP it. Yeah. So like, so I was like, he kills one if he comes in. So I was like, it's not worth you coming in with this smash captain. Yeah. So I was like, and then that one will probably come over. And then I was like, I'll swoop in dive him. I didn't expect you to commit with two. That's why I, I had, had to do it because I, I had to get that guy in yeah. to stop the other two units stooping dive the good guy. Yeah, because I was like, captain. if you commit two, I swooping dive, and then I interrupt. Yeah, yeah. So I was like, there's no way you commit two. Yeah. So that's why I was like, one smash captain, fine, I'll probably kill him before he even strikes. Yeah. If not, he probably kills one bike. Yeah. Yeah. So I was like, that's fine. I can oh, deal okay, with that. Yeah. It was just the both coming <laughs> I just in made surprising sure, you. Yeah, I made, sure the, I made sure the centurions couldn't get me, flame me, or try and assault me, and you know, do anything like that. Yeah. So I was like, oh, one smash captain, I can deal with that. I just, I, I did not, I did not expect that. I thought I had yeah. a plan. Uh, Two wounds. Weren't they uh, my saves? No. Wasn't that my saves? <laughs> oh yeah, that was four. <laughs> I'll take two, mate, if you oh, want me to. Sorry, <laughs> sorry mate. Yeah. Uh, three ups. Uh, yeah, he did. Yep, he's dead. <sighs> he did. No, that's my warlord. It's my advance and charge yeah. all gone, Dan. <laughs> okay. What a guy. What a guy. <laughs> what a guy. Okay, that's right. So my hammer sundrance guy is going to shoot the bike captain. Yep. Because um, these have got four wounds anyway, right? But I've only got to get two through on him, flat three, and then he dies. Oh, with the hammer sundrance, yeah. Yeah. Six shots. We roll the one. Oh yeah, because I can. Oh no, 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 because then I don't reroll once. Oh, because I hit. moved. Because you moved. Yeah. Oh yes, it's whether I would order them. Oh yeah. To reroll once it's or reroll whether you'd reroll the number of shots or reroll ones. Uh huh. If you reroll the number of shots, you might get another like two shots. But then rerolling ones, it just means you have to roll ones to be able to reroll them. Uh huh. So. Reroll shots, I think. You think? Yeah. I think statistically that's better. I think so, statistically, yeah. Um, I don't think it's a, ma it's a massive difference. Go on, I'll go with that. Yep. Ten shots. Mm -hmm. So it gives you four. It gives you four extra shots there, but you would have had to roll four ones to counter that, and you've not rolled enough three. dice. But that's cool too. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Another two shots if you want them, Dan. <laughs> oh, there you go. Four ones. Okay. <laughs> oh, but you uh, you would have to roll four ones and then hit with them all <laughs> to get the same number of shots, basically. Uh, three. Three? It's possible, mate. I, I could fail two here. No, he's all right. Uh, and then he has to have a heavy ball on the front, doesn't he? Yeah. Yeah. And I moved so the one doesn't shoot. One, one wound off that. Three up. Oh. Okay. Uh, two more battle cannons. Now those centurions. Oh man, that's the thing, man. Oh, you had to kill both here. Yeah. You had to kill both here. That's I think. why I was like, I just kill him. Just kill him with the with the flat three damage. Yeah, and, and then you would two do two battle cannons into him. Try to kill two centurions or something. Yeah. Yeah. I was about to say, because those Centurions can't advance and charge you now, but I don't think they need to. Because they've got uh, three up save on that cover, right? Yeah, so yeah. Threes, no matter where I go. Oh, yes, threes, no matter where you go. Oh, yes, yeah, so you're better off trying to kill the guy that's only got six wounds yeah. rather than so you can 16 do... wounds. Yeah. And also, it depends who you target. Because <laughs> I think if you went for the Centurions, I probably would transhuman right now. Yeah. <laughs> to make you wound them on force. <laughs> you got transhuman on him? I don't think so. I believe it's an infantry unit. Oh, okay. Yeah. It would be nice if it was infantry and bikes, but I, I, th I think it's infantry on him. Oh, bloody hell, that should do it. Well, these are D3 now. Yeah, but you never know. You might, you might, you might be able to fire your last one into Centurions. Or you could just pass all of his invulnerables. <laughs> Happy boys. 
Then the last guy. Oh no! We needed to kill them both and I have to kill one! Uh, See, the real shots shot, is. The real, yeah. the real number of shots is huge, man. Man, they rolled. The thing is, right? They've killed one smash, Captain. No, they've killed nothing! No, they've killed nothing. And they've rolled 10, 11, and 10 on their shots. Uh, four? <laughs> you better hope that some of these have failed. Or one. One. <laughs> Brilliant. Three. Three. Oh my god. The one that went through was ridiculously reliable, and the rest is just. But I passed way too many vulnerable saves there. He should be dead. Oh, yeah, but that, three ups. That does happen with three ups, alright? Yeah, it does, yeah. Okay, um, so charging then. The server sword going to go in. Yeah. The thing is, he should be dead, but those Centurions, man. They're just... 11. Man. You know what it is? I think it's the point sync, right? For example, um, you've still got more than a thousand points on the board. You've still got more than half your army in oh. just like six models. Yeah. I think it's the, the amount of points, isn't it? I think because each unit of them is 270 and then each one of them is 200. Mm. As in, you, have, you have a bit of a... You roll a, a couple of bad dice. With an army with your big like stuff, yeah, 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 and that's it. You, yeah. you, you're just down. So well, that could have gone so different. I could have lost like three bikes then. Yeah, and then I have another unit. You should have. You should have. Yeah. The, you know that second one where I put five saves on you, if you failed two. Yeah. That should be like two bikes dead. But the first one where I put four saves on you with yeah. a reroll, you don't lose one bike. <laughs> so okay. it's a bit. It's a bit mental the way that it switched. Yeah, I, I I didn't expect you to put the two smash captains in because I was like, oh, if he puts, if, you know, that's the golden rule, isn't it? You never commit two smash captains. Yeah, you never commit because people captains. interrupt and then you kill have to the other go one. on different units and different angles and to stop something doing it's something yeah, if you're going to do it. It's because you had the scouts in there as well. The only reason I did it is because no one really expects you to do it. Yeah. Uh, the only reason I did it is I did that at the ETC last year when I took this army. Yeah. Right, when I took the remember my old Imperium. Yeah. So it was the. Um, uh, with the shield captains and the Blood Angel smash captains. And I charged in um, Mephiston and two smash captains into a guy's custodes turn one at different angles. Yeah. And it meant that like two guys could hit Meph and then two have to hit a smash captain. Then one has to hit oh, another okay, smash captain. Yeah. And he couldn't. And then I killed like 10 custody bikes in yeah. the first turn. Yeah. Uh, there you go. Uh, that is five, five dead, right? Minus yep. one? Yep. Uh-oh. Dead scouties. But there's Butcher's Bill. <laughs> <laughs> Scouts on a smash captain. <laughs> silver linings, Dan. Silver linings. <laughs> Just look for as many silver linings as we can. Well, they'll stand there on that objective, I suppose. Yeah. Okay. Well, that gets me Butcher's Bill. Kill something. And, um... Uh, hold something. Recon. One here, one there, one there, one there. What do you use? No, oh, I, I, no, no. I, don't, I don't think I've got enough. To oh, no, not past the objective. I don't, I don't think I've got anywhere near enough. <laughs>Oh then guys, so as you can see there, what I've done is I've brought down a Centurion Assault Squad there and this Centurion Assault Squad here and then I brought down my, my Vanguard here and here to deal with the Assassin. The Vanguard here and here to deal with the Assassin because that will get me the bonus point, so that's huge. Uh, the Obviously the Librarian to cast plus two charge on them and if that works, huge. Uh, <laughs> everything's just huge. Yeah, and then uh, these two squads here they have come down so that they can so that those 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 two squads where did they come down <laughs> oh yeah now I remember they come down so they can flame these guys within 11 inches and they've got 27 inch hurricane bolters to try and shoot them of course I'm switching into the tactical doctrine here uh, and then these guys have got their flamers here and these aggressors have come in to flame these guys and I am outside of shooting them outside of 18 so uh, th they've they've come on to get rid of these guys they're going to flame these guys and try to charge that shield captain. And the these centurions here are going to try and kill them and them. 
and these guys are going to try and get into him. So let's see how the plan works. So first of all, cast no Overwatch on someone. I think I'm just casting powers for the lols. <laughs> I'm going to cast no Overwatch on the squad that's going to try and charge the Eversaur. Uh, a 10, so plus 1, 11, nice. And then I'm going to try and do uh, plus 2 charge on them. Uh, an 8, plus 1, 9, so that's okay as well. So they're, they're going to try and charge him, essentially. As you can see, Manny quite obviously feels sorry for the Custodes and the... <laughs> and the Imperial Guard and is, you know, just just easing off the throttle a little bit. <laughs> Obviously. Yeah, trying to leave something on the board. <laughs> I, mate, I, I will leave you something, okay? I will leave you something. <laughs> I want you to have a turn three, okay? I'm not that I'm not that heartless, okay? Manny's obviously desperate mate, to get to the bar. The, it's the it's the it's the Marines. <laughs> Power! <laughs> He's just Darth Sidious in me, <laughs> making me feel like Darth Sidious. Um, that's all my powers, can't do anything else. Uh, I failed my litany, so there's something for you now. Two turns in a row, may I add? Pretty unlucky. <laughs> uh, and then let's do some shooting. So I suppose the main things are just, well, these aggressors can't shoot anything but these guys. So I'm just going to put all their guns into them now. Well, they're dead then. And then, um, oh. it's, it's all minus one now as well, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. All their bolter yeah. shots are all, all the minus, shots one. minus one. God so they're just damn. going to go straight to them. Yep. And then um, this this squad here, they're going to put all of their flamers into those uh, those guys, and they are as well. So twelve d six flamers at them, minus one as well, into them. Yeah, go on because I can take you out of range, right? Yes. So yeah. the, the first squad, yeah, uh, and obviously all the hurricanes are on them. First squad. Um, oh, well, they've got two flamers each. Obviously. Sorry, when you said twelve d six, I thought that was from like both. Yeah. Both squads. No, you're doing one 66 squad. Sixty-six and sixty-six. Yeah, you're rolling one squad at a time, okay. right? Ten. Twenty-one. Twenty-six shots. Of the first six. D six. What do you mean off the first? Off the first six. Six d six. Six d six. That's where twelve d six comes from. Oh. They have two, two, God. two flamers. Oh, did you not know this? Ugh. Yeah, that's why. That's why I wanted the extra range because I'm like, that's seven hits guaranteed from each guy when you come down within eleven inches. <laughs> that's horrendous, right? That's pretty good. Right? Yeah. So it's this twice, threes, uh, with artisans. So uh, eleven. <laughs> eleven and eight. Uh, 19 six ups. You might be able to take me out of range. <laughs> Just that twice. Um, oh, damn. We lost four mortars. And then. Uh, oh, oh, it's only nine mortars dead. That mate. was close. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was like 3d6 from one. So I was like, I could take you out of range of one and make this slightly harder for you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I can see what you thought. <laughs> no, I wouldn't. Um, if it was only three d six, I wouldn't bother with the extra with the the range, the masterful yeah. marksman range They're or whatever. Two d six each. Yeah. Plus. Plus this. Jesus. Hurricanes off the first unit. So they they've changed it, haven't they? So I'm full range thingy, and obviously I'm twenty seven inches on hurricane bowlers. Okay. Let's see how many of these we can drop. So hitting on threes. So you know these assault ones, they've got the flamers and the hurricane bolters. Mm -hmm. Do the devastator ones, do they have the flamers, the hurricane bolters, and Not the, the heavy bolters? Not they the flamers. don't have the flamers. Man, yeah, this plus yeah, three the flamers is really good. Still fails. Yeah, I, I, see, I see what you mean now. Yeah, yeah, man. I see what you mean. I mean, a unit of three, they come down and they fire basically 21 hits on one unit. Yeah. And then 36 hurricane bolt shots on another unit, which is about 21 hit, 24 hits. So you get 21 hits on something and 24 hits on something with minus one guns. Four. That's brutal, isn't it? Five to wound. Yeah. Uh, artisans. Three ups. Yeah. One, two, three. Yeah. And then the second squad's hurricane bolt is at them. Obviously, flamers into no one. 
Okay, what was that one? Uh, Artisan's one of them. I like that Artisan's. I think it's really good. It, yeah, it's... It starts piling up on things. Yeah, it's... Yeah. it's it's because the salamanders thing, right? Yeah. And I remember yeah. people saying how good salamanders were before. Like, you know, those people weren't playing them that much. But you can see and what they were going on about now. People do say Jammy Manny quite a bit. But I don't know how many times there are more fives than... than... one, two, three, and fours. <laughs> one, two, three... Four, five. Four, five. So three and five is eight. Eight. Two bikes gone. Wow, that's insane! <laughs> that's hurricane bolters! That's hurricane bolters! <laughs> no way! Have they just killed 180 points worth of custodes with hurricane bolters? That's insane. That is actually insane. Yeah, I, I didn't think you'd kill them. <laughs> no, no mate, neither did I. Alright, come on then. I'm, I'm, these are flaming these, right? No. <laughs> Because that's going to do a lot of damage if I can get in because I know now that that minus one's pretty good. I'm going to thunder fire the mortars. <laughs> well, okay, yeah, cool. Yeah, so the, the the first unit. I'm loving it, I'm loving it. Uh, nine. That should be enough, hopefully. We're on twos, all of them. Uh, winning on threes uh, with artisans. Nope. Seven. Six um, ups. Only minus one, yeah, so six ups. Nope. Mm. Oh no. Mm. Got one left. Got one left. Got one left. Yep. Uh, three pistols from the scouts in front of them. Triple hit. Two wounds. Oh. He tried. He tried. He tried. And then the uh, second Thunderfire. We'll go at the Eversaw. Oh, actually, no. Because he's a ca he's a character, isn't he? Yeah. So I can target anyone now. So I uh, will put the second Thunderfire on him. Oh, actually. Oh, oh yeah, actually. Yeah. yeah sorry. Second Thunderfire on no, him. No, don't you want to flame them first? Because so, if they kill him, then you need to. Oh, yeah, sorry. Yeah, I'll give him a Thunderfire somewhere else. Two, four, six, eight, eight D6. That's the thing, man. Like, the, the flamers are insane. The amount of shots you get. You can put the Hurricane Bolt into him as well. Uh, they don't have hurricanes, remember, because they advance every turn. Oh uh, yeah. Six. Ten and ten. Twenty-six. That's eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Is this twice? It's not going to be as many as I thought. I don't think. Six on the first half. Master artisans. Four there. So four plus six. Three ups. Mm -hmm. Because of tactical doctrine. Two. One, two. Cool. She's got five over only. Five, yeah, he's got five left. Three. No, no, he has seven. He's a shield captain, bro. He's got seven wounds. Yeah. Oh, wow, I didn't know that. That's why I used to put Victor of the Blood games on him, man. Three up in vulnerable with rerolls with a five up feel no pain on your warlord. Ah. With seven wounds is crazy. That's awesome. Yeah, so he's Love got it. five left. So uh, yeah, first first under fire cannon then. Yeah. I will uh Actually you know what? Those company commanders are annoying me. I'll uh <laughs> No I'm gonna shoot at that. I'm gonna shoot the shield company captain. Command, huh? Shoot the shield captain. Two extra there. One extra there, one extra there. Uh twos. Master Artisans. And then fives to wound him, I believe. Top of six. And Master Artisans. Three. This is the one. Down to four. Yeah. And the third one. I want to put him down to three. So if I get my charge, I only have to get one wound through. Uh, two more there. One there, one there. Twos. Master Artisans. Oh. <laughs> wow, that was pretty poor. Fives. No, I need one wound on him! <laughs> yeah, so that's all of that fired. I was going to fire one twice until I remembered I need the 3D the pick the highest with my yeah, charge yeah, yeah. to get into the episode. That's, Otherwise, he's going to live with me. That's really cool. Yeah. That's, um, that's right. 
Is it one CP, is it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Um, I think that's all my shooting, right? Thank God. Pretty much? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah, okay. So, let's attempt some crazy stuff. Um, they're going to charge him. Yeah? No, they're not. They only rolled a six. Good. Um, so I need these, basically. So, I don't know how to do this. Do I make the guys that have a 9-inch charge pick the two highest? And then the guys that have the 7-inch charge charge normally? Uh, have you got any CP? How many CPs you got? Two. So, I can 3D6 someone 3D6. and then... Uh, 3d6 of the guys with a big charge and then 2d6 with a reroll. How many guys can you guys. actually get in to punch him now? Everyone. Can you? Yeah. Just because obviously the one guy. Yeah. So just do a there. Two wounds. On the Centurions? Yeah. Two ups. They take one. Yes! Oh. <laughs> no! No! You're bringing them down, mate. You're yes. bringing them down. <laughs> And so it begins. <laughs> and so it begins. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, I'll go yeah, for the... Uh, Why not? Go ballsy. Yeah, go ballsy. 3D6, 3D6 on these guys, then. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes ever so. He's ducking and dodging and weaving. So I can't CP that one, because I need a 5 plus on that. And then I'll need to roll a 7 on the others. Oh, I'm going to do it. Why not? 5 plus. CP roll this one as well. So both my command points into that one unit. You know. <laughs> Five plus. There you go. <laughs> I hate you so much. <laughs> uh, pistol? He's got a 12 inch range, isn't he? Pistol. Oh yeah, I should have gone with the no overwatchers first, shouldn't one. I? One. Two late now, sucker. Head on it. That's cool. Yeah. So it's like that. I mean, it's mad because you get the two guys in an inch and then everyone's with an inch of them. Um, yeah. so you can fight. You can fight with like twenty guys, I think. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and then inches. the two d six charge with no reroll, Failed. seven inches. Eight. That's fine. No justice in this world. <laughs> no justice in this world. This is why bad people always prosper. <laughs> Not a bad person. I'm a really nice guy. Ask anybody that I've played. All right, I'm a lovely guy. There we go. 14 guys. I think that should kill him. I, 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 had, I wanted to try and get both in oh, to I kill him. Because I, 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 I don't think one will. Because remember, I don't have any extra damage or anything like that. They're just chainsaws. It's just a load of chainsaws. And you have six wounds. I've got a four up in one. Yeah, and you've got like six wounds. Oh, so that's all my command points gone? But I got all the charges off that I wanted to get off. Well, I've got four left. I haven't got any units to use them on, so you can use some of mine if you oh, want me. I failed that. I failed that one. That's huge, man. <laughs> that's huge. All right, here we go. This is huge. Chaplain into your company commander. Oh, okay, that's not huge. Bang. That's boring. Bang. It's gonna kill him. Uh, and then the ult le le yeah. ultimate. Come on. He's gonna go into this tank commander right here. Come on, boy. Uh, five shots. Oh my god. We got this. Oh my god. Come on, mate. Come on. Two hits, two fails. One hit. Okay. Uh, can I kill you with one? Yeah, I can. I can. I can. The dream's alive. It's yeah, fine. Yeah. Nope. Never mind. Uh oh. Eight inches! Stupid game. We've got four CP left, haven't we? So I'm going to go on this side. <laughs> Just for in case he wants to counter charge. It's a bit of a long one. What is it? Oh yeah, actually check what it is, yeah. That's, that's, a, that's a good point. Needs to roll a 10? Uh, yeah, a 10. Do I have to do something that's charged? Can I go into that? Yeah, yeah, it's just at the end of my charge phase. That's a 9 inch charge. Yeah. Do you have to overwatch me? Oh, Obviously, yeah, you're just charging me. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, okay, because I've got a reroll as well. Yeah. So I'm going to swoop and dive mm -hmm. over to this guy. Right, so I need a 10. Oh, hold on. See the end of my charge phase. So, give me two glass on my dice. I'm going to charge him with three scouts. Stop this. Okay, Bollocks. hang on, hang on. Hang on. <laughs> two, four. 
<laughs> There's chance I get to kill something in your turn. <gasps> Hold on, Dan. You have you have four command points. Yeah. You can already re-roll your charge for the three swooping dive. Yeah. Might as well use one CP to hit Overwatch on fives with this guy. No, because swooping dive's three. And you can re-roll because of your relic bike. Oh yeah. So then use one for this Overwatch on five because it's okay. three scouts. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Overwatch on five. So that's all you CP gone. Yeah. Well, actually, only one gone so far. If you don't kill any scouts and they get in. Two, three. They'll get you. Four. Yes. You can do it. Three. Oh my god. Oh my god. One lives. Ah. Take him off in the front. One lonely guy. <laughs> Will he make his charge and stop this cunning plan? No. No. Yes. Uh-oh. Okay. okay. So now you can use your three. There you go. Okay. We are all out. Okay. It's ten inches, was it? Oh, actually, just before you do, because if you fail this, you have to, you have to charge, you have to reroll both dice. I used that and another one yeah. and the one from last turn, and you haven't been. Rerolling to get them, so you get three rolls. Oh yeah, that's true. You, use three three CPs. you get one, so you're on one. So just in case you want to reroll one of the dice, yeah, you okay. roll a six and something. You've got it. Uh, okay, I roll four. I'm not going to keep either of those. <laughs> Do it. Ten. Do it. Five. Jesus Christ. <laughs> he ain't going nowhere. <laughs> he ain't going nowhere. Stupid gay. You took too many wounds, mate, that's what it was. <laughs> you took them three wounds and he was like, I'm not going into that flame war. Are you mad? <laughs> you mad, bro. Oh, does that mean I just get to overwatch him for free now? No, because you're in combat, aren't you? Did you go for both? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> just checking if you lost the plot or not. I'm just going to run into them. Just checking if you lost Give the plot, yeah? Give you a second chance to kill him. Mr. Mr. Big Boy over there. Mm. Hitting on threes. It's a miss, there's a miss. Last draft is then? Oh no, he's white scars. Nah, he's white scars, yeah. Uh, four plus. One. Good. Six there. Nope. Bullshark! It takes three. Yeah. And then he's obviously gonna go. Kaboom! Superb. I told you I was gonna leave you a tank commander to shoot, and I did. Alright, so don't hate me. <laughs> One hit. One wound. Oh, one wound. Oh my god. Oh, he's alright. He's oh. alright. Right. And then over here, I got one. Is it what? Two, two attacks for being a vanguard, one for charging, one for having one chainsaw? Yeah. So I've got four, 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 oh, and four. Dead. That's, that's, the, that's the four guys with storm shields. And then I've got five attacks on two different guys because they've got double chainsaw and six attacks on the sergeant. He's got two chainsaws. This is a crazy amount of attacks, man, for seven vanguard. These were just like my, you know, they'll come down and kill weak units if they're still alive, turn three and stuff. It's 130 points a squad. Yeah, yeah. 100, 127 points a squad. I, re cheap. I really like the vanguard, but I, I always put them in my list. They're really cheap. Just because when they move in advance, they cover so much ground. Yeah, they do. And they can string back to get the no overwatch on them, and I find them really useful. They are really good. Oh, that's like nothing. See, this is what I mean. Don't look, there's that many rooms. Kind of four there. Oh. One, two, three. So we just need the other squad to do about the same. <laughs> oh, that was only one squad. Yeah. It's because like uh, three of them have got double chainsaws, and then four of them have only got have still got one chainsaw as well. So it's a bucket ton of attacks, oh, man. Oh, poor Crazy man, man his marines not good enough. Oh, oh no, mate, I'm loving them. <laughs> yeah, that Come should on. be the end of him. Come on, that was the oh. end of him. The end of him. Yeah, he's yeah. finished. He did. He's finished. Okay, this squad. Blow up on that squad. Yes. <coughs> and the other squad? Oh. oh no, so there's one, one mortal wound. Oh, okay. And on okay. the other squad? No. Killed the guy. Ugh. That's right. I'll give it you. I'll give it you. Have your little guy back. 
Actually, you know what? I'm quite, f I'm quite glad I failed that charge. Uh, and you didn't make yours back. Oh no, you charged him, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, I'm quite glad I, I failed that charge. Because it's the bonus point. Oh, would you look at that? Even when it goes wrong for money, it goes right. Oh, the chap El Chapelino is going to try and kill that one company commander. All hit. Uh, twos. With Master Artisans. Three wounds. Five invulnerable. Two. Two. That's four oh. damage. Oh, that's him dead. And then I don't really want you screening and stuff, so I'm going to consolidate into the boat over there. Okay. Uh, can I shake your hand yet? Yeah, I think, uh, I think that's... I, I think. I think. I mean, the hammer <laughs> of sundrance is good. <laughs> But hang on, just before I, um, hang on. In my turn. Oh, okay, you want to see if he can kill him. Oh, him. He's passed too many bloody through. He shouldn't even be alive. He should be dead. And he will be dead. Stone cold dead. Stone cold dead. Five hits. I think you've got a bit too much faith in your guy, mate. Oh, five Five wounds. Oh, so I can see why you got Come faith. Come on. Though. Yeah, three. Yeah. Three D three. That is. Ah, he, he did. He did. Good game, mate. Just a game, bro. Game. That's just. I wanted to see how well the marine list that I built would do, and that's a bit. Oof. Bonkers. Right then, guys. So we wanted to show you exactly why, <laughs> what Raven Guard were doing this weekend at uh, the Glass Hammer oh. Open, and um, that was pretty much it. Basically, uh, they're just that Alpha Strike is amazing. I think you go first or second. That's the thing, because man. It's just a beat. It's a beta strike. Yeah, yeah. Because we've got uh, we, we we really like heavy boards when we're playing because it makes the game really interesting and stuff. But Raven Guard really maximised that. Like, if, if with heavy boards, like because it, think about it, it doesn't matter how much out of line of sight shooting. You could have your your ETC list right there, right, with all the wibbons and all the mortars and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. Are you going to shift those units, of those three units of centurions out of cover? Probably not. No way, no. it's not going to happen. Toughness no. 5 with a 2 up save. Well, it's a, it's a 1 up save, isn't it? In there, it, it, they just can't clear them. So they just they, they, they have these zones and they're just so shooty and they're so good in combat. So it's like, you can sit and shoot me all day and nothing's going to work. And um, if you come anywhere near me, this is my zone of death and you're yeah. all going to die. And, and uh, you know they've got they've got the speed to get in there. I mean, if they do go first, and you do have any kind of threat that will do something, they just beat the crap out of it. There's yeah. no, they just go in. Oh, that's dead. Okay, then I'll sit here for the rest of the game and win. And, and that's pretty much what we saw. And, and and you know, if you're an elite member, you can go on and watch the games back. And uh, you can see even on um, uh, Vic and Sam played in the final round at Raven Guard on Raven Guard, and. Um, they tried to be a bit sneaky, you know, uh, Vic got first turn, Sam tried to be a bit sneaky and stuff like that, but, yeah. I mean, it, it, going first, and I think Vic went in, didn't he, with his Centurions and his Smash Captains and just just wiped out a bunch of Sam stuff, yeah, so, yeah. And, I mean, that's what's going to happen, because as you saw, you can't hide from it, because you, can use, really that, big. you can use that redeploy Warlord trait, and you can use the move stratagem, yeah. there's nothing stopping you using the two, and that's what a lot of people were asking questions about on the weekend and there's nothing stopping you you can do the both yep, of them yep, yep. it's just if you get first turn um, you decide in which order it goes ahead so um, if you know obviously if, if you're if the Raven Guard guy tries to do it then you would say well you would you're going to you're going to move first then you're going to redeploy yeah, yeah, so it's, yeah. Pointless, for it's pointless for them but you know and, and especially with this but you wouldn't do it if your opponent was going first anyway yeah, I don't know whether you know if you were trying to get into a piece of terrain or something. I, I don't yeah, know, that's but, what I mean. Um, yeah, it's so Raven Guard guys, Raven Guard. So you know, Iron Hands kind of came in, didn't they? And um, Tried everyone to steal was them, Iron yeah. Hands, Iron Hands, Iron Hands. And then, like, because we used the the Arata in the tournament this weekend, Raven Guard just came out all guns blazing, like from jumping out behind these Iron Hands, <laughs> and no one saw it coming. I mean. I mean, I, I had Raven Guard as picked as one of the because because I thought they've got some tricks that people won't know and they'll catch people out. Yeah. So I liked Ra I, uh, Raven Guard to win the tournament anyway, but not in the way that it did. I expected them to be sneaky and tricksy and stuff like that. Yeah. But they came out just they just just, just finishing finishing games turn two. 
Turn two. Face. That's exactly what they were doing. They were just <laughs> finishing games. Turn two. There were so many Raven Guard players just stood right doing nothing. <laughs> it's just. <laughs> it's crazy. It's so that is good. crazy. I love it. I think that's brilliant. I mean, as you just saw there, what Centurions? Six, six Centurions. We just with Hurricane Bolters mm -hmm. killed eight wounds worth. That they were wounding on fives mm -hmm. with a two-up save. Yeah. I don't think I rolled that unlucky. No. You rolled that lucky. No. It was. It was. It's, it's just way it shot, isn't it? You know and that I mean? was with no rerolls. I had no captain, no chapter master, yeah. nothing. Yeah, nothing. So it's crazy. I mean, if that's eight wounds with a two up save, mm -hmm. that's roughly about 10, 11 wounds with a three up save. Mm -hmm. So they yeah. would have killed a tank. They yeah. would have come down and killed a tank with no rerolls. Yeah. How crazy is that? That's pretty bonkers. So, guys. Good news, Games Workshop have Centurion Devastators back in stock. Woo woo! <laughs> <laughs> if you want to order any, I mean, I've I've got about 20 boxes in stock at the moment. <laughs> like, because I've just been ordering stupid amounts. So, um, if you Crazy. want some, go on the Glass Hammer website and order yours now, because they're going to be everywhere. And I imagine they're only going to get worse with Imperial Fists. Yeah. Uh, but, well, you know, when, when uh, you're, if you look I on think... the Glass Hammer Facebook page, and um, we'll be doing reviews of the books when they drop. We're going to be getting them soon. Uh, open the vaults. Uh, we'll definitely have something on there. But um, but yeah, guys, short and sweet and uh, to the point. That's that's kind of the thing that we wanted to show you. Yeah, so. that's what Raven God do. And I think the only thing that I would perhaps try out uh, just to see how that works in the list is what Dan suggested to me halfway through the game is that I had two White Scars Vanguard units. But if I keep one of them as white scars, they can still do the all the drop behind terrain, advance with plus two and charge and all of that kind of mm. stuff with no overwatch on them. So that's good. Yeah. But then if I make the other unit Raven Guard, it, you know, it takes nothing. I just got to take it out of one detachment and put it in the other one. Mm. So it costs nothing, but it allows me to be able to redeploy them if I so wish uh -huh. at the start of the game, then move and advance inside my opponent's deployment zone and then move and advance again and charge, yeah. which I think is huge. Or you could do exactly what you did with the sense, because you can move and advance as many units as you want. So you drop the sense nine inches away from your deployment zone, and then you put the Raven Guard on the front. On the front line. Because you, what yeah. you can do, you can hide your sense, but your Raven Guard on the, on the, on the your, sorry, your Vanguard bet's on the front line. That way, you, you, if you go first, you redeploy your sense, then you move and advance your, your Vanguard, and then you move, advance them, and then charge. So they're, they're both in their face. But if you hide your sense and say your opponent steals the initiative on you, you just redeploy the, the vanguard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back yeah. and hide in. So now everyone's there. hiding again. So you've got you've got nothing to lose. You've got so many options. You've got nothing to lose by just putting them on the front line and going, if I go first, mate, I'm going to punch you in the dick. So you've got to <laughs> go back over there, so, yeah, deploy yeah, all the way yeah. over there so in the if, corner. So if you're not on your on your back line, then you're going to get assaulted. That's and then, um, but then, then they go, And it okay, means they then, have to go first. Yep. Yeah. Because if they don't, then they know that that unit is double advancing yep. and the sensor redeploying by them and double advancing. Yeah. So it's whichever way it is, whichever way it is. That's crazy. I didn't think about it like that. It's hard. I didn't it's think hard. about it like that. But so I think I will try that out. <laughs> I love that list, man. I love that list. So yeah, that was also, that was also showing you guys as well. I've not seen many people playing with the um, successor chapters. Successors, yeah. That much. A lot of people have been playing pure white, white scars or iron hands or raven guard. That just shows you can play with them a bit. 11 inch use. flamers for the win. 11, 11 inch flamers, flamers for the win. When he was telling me about it, I was like, mm, it sounds all right. But I, did, I didn't realize, I didn't realize they had two, two flamers, flamers each. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that's actually really cool. That's really cool. Uh, right guys, um, there'll be more marine goodness for definite in next week's elite only battle report. So if you want to see more of these kind of showcasing uh, battle reports, please sign up today on the Glass Hammer Gaming website. So if you are an Elite member, we'll see you next week.